Welcome back to Brotherman Gaming, and we are back with some Banjo Kazooie. As you can see, we got eight more notes to collect on Click Clock Wood. Let's just go for it. I think I know where they are. These are the last eight notes in the game, boys and girls. Let's go. No time to waste. I think, I mean, we've made the mistake of looking, oh god, we do not have many feathers in this motherfucker. <laughs> uh, I made the mistake of looking for it in every other season. Oh god, we're already at the top. That was fast. That's what she said. We've made the mistake of looking for it in every other season, like on that little tree house. So I think, oh god, I think, um, come on now, yeah, I think that is gonna have some notes for us, hopefully, yes, <laughs> and now, what, no, oh god, that is not good. Okay, thank God there's no bees in winter. <laughs> oh, that that was so close. I can't even. <coughs> and we only have 20 feathers. Oh, buddy, oh, pal. All right, I think we can just climb it. Because I think that's what I used to do. Is do some little flip tricks up there. And uh, maybe we'll see the other ones. We'll dodge some snowmen's on the way there. Oh god. Okay. Yeah, you proved your point. Also, there's no birds in winter, which is very nice. You know, you can just cur Okay, here we go. Here's the other ones. Oh god, but this camera doesn't make it easy. Oh my this camera does not make it easy. And BAM! I didn't think we were gonna lose anything. Oh, God. Okay, but there's also the snow, the icicles we can get life off of. See, we're at that point where we keep falling so much that we're like, please give me enemies, please. And we can't afford to take hits off the enemies. Oh, God. Fuck. This, this level, I love this level, but man, the jumping physics. Okay, I don't want- Oh my god, the- The- Camera! You can- You can feel the freak out, can't you? I hope you can. Now, spam eggs. I wish it was an automatic one, because they always seem to get me when uh, the egg shooting stops. Alright, four life is good. Four or five. Let's go back up there. My heart rate is crazy right now over Banjo-Kazooie. Because this ain't the port, babies. We gotta go back up to 93, 94, whatever the fuck we got if we, if we die. 93, 94 spread over four seasons. Oh, come on. Fuck this camera angle. Fuck this camera angle. Fuck this snowman. Dude, oh my fuck. At least I didn't take damage. Oh. I'm gonna go for the ones on the rooftop. Oh. All right, I'm gonna go feather by feather. Literally feathering it. So many guys laughing at me right now. Okay, here we go. One more. <laughs> dude, 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 no banjo, no banjo. All right, all right, all right. Four more notes to go. Oh my God, frame drops. Holy shit. Wow, 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 wee wow. 
All right, four more. All right, let's get this honeycombs. Fuck you, Robin Hood. Jesus Christ, no one invited you to the party. Oh my God. Wow, 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 we wow. All right, we have 13 feathers. That should get us up to those notes. All right. Freaking out a little bit here, guys. I don't want these snowmen to be the death of me now. I've been lost inside this place. <laughs> and I don't even know where that thing... Oh, Robin Hood. No, you weren't invited. So many people trying to destroy me. Oh, now another giant ice cube. You know what? It's gonna take like five, I think, to do the charge, because I was gonna say like, you know what, should I just do the boost on the Iceman? But fuck, I don't think it's worth it. Especially now that I've ate, these things barely shoot you up. Oh my god. Ugh. I'm scared and disoriented. Where was that snowman? Is it this guy? It is this guy, I think, yeah. Okay, you know what? Let's shoot up and bang him. Yes! Alright, that'll make things easier. Yeah. Uh oh Alright. Oh, baby, I can taste it, and it tastes sweet. It really tastes good. It tastes like when you first tasted, like, a cheeseburger. Oh, baby. Oh. Yeah! Oh, my God, I can't fucking see. All right. Oh, let's view those totals. Oh, click clock wood has been defeated. But we got to do one more thing here. Well, we got to dodge these snowballs. I think there is actually something here on this dead tree. Oh my god, some lore or something. If this a snowman could stop killing me. No, nothing here. <laughs> some lore. Uh, we got to go back to spring. We gotta go back to springtime. Oh my god, snowman! Just blocking the path. I didn't realize how many snowmen were in this winter time. Um, so yeah, we gotta go back to spring. And then we are officially done with Click Clock Wood. Now you might be at- Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so flip turned upside down right now. Everything looks- I did a complete circle because everything looks the same. Especially in wintertime, everything's just frozen over. Um, now you might be asking yourselves, Hey, why do we gotta go back to spring? And then I might be telling you, well, there's that little thing called the Layer Jiggy, which uh, we gotta transform back into the Bumblebee, which is only available in spring, cause in the other season, I almost called them uh, Mango. <laughs> uh, oh, this is summer. In the other seasons, Mumbo's always doing some other garbage, you know. I think s summer's on vacation, fall, he is um, on, uh, if all he's sweeping the leaves, and I didn't even bother to check in, um, what do you call it, winter, but he's, he, you can't, you can only transform in spring. So we get to see this uh, and hear the cool little theme one last time. You know, 
You get to go over our achievements that we uh, collected here. It's a nice, you know. It's reminiscent of the first time you uh, went through Click Clock Wood. Naughty, we already helped you out, man. Is it, it is funny to me, though, that everyone spawns back in except for Gobi. I don't know why that's so weird to me, but it is. And are these guys... Yes, they're still here. I think this might be the catchiest tune in the game. Wow, these honey... These honeycombs are still here if you go through different seasons. That's crazy. Like, if you kill an enemy, then go to a different season and come back, their honeycomb's still here. That's that's good programming. Like, there's games today that won't do that. Anyway, let's stop guffawing over this game. And get to Mumbo. Uh, let's get these feathers just in case we need them. I don't think... Well, we might be done with feathers for the game, honestly. Because, I mean, this is the last level in the game. Um, so let's transform back into Mumbo. Or back into Mumbo. Back into the bee. Mumbo, thank you for your services. You've helped us... You've helped us learn a lot about ourselves. You know, when you transform into something else, you're just like, I kind of miss my regular self, you know? I'm not cut out for the bee life, you know? Serving the queen? What the fuck is this? Well, get me back into Banjo. And what happens to Kazooie during these? Are you just one? Are you one person? One entity? Alright. So... Just like, um, I'm trying to think, there, the Mad Monster Mansion one, I think you did this, and the first, um, layer jigsaw, you did this, um, you gotta go back, oh my god, these controls with the B though are not ideal, <laughs> it's like, yeah, you shoot up, but how the fuck do you land, um, you go back to the witch's lair with the transformation in order to get the layer jiggy. So, let's go back to the lair, which is kind of odd. It lets you go back to the lair, but none of the other seasons. A little weird, but I guess I get it. Because because it didn't let you go to any of the seasons, um, I, I didn't think you'd be able to go to the lair as the bee. And it took me forever to figure out how to get to the, um, what do you call it, lair jigsaw. But you just gotta fly up here. There's no glitch to be able to get it. But as you see, we are still at nine jigsaw pieces. Um, because, and I looked over the footage, and when I was looking over the footage, I vividly remember this happening. When I did the um, Mumbo Mountain layer jigsaw, right after I did that episode, uh, my uh, cartridge glitched like um completely froze so we're gonna have to redo that layer jigsaw which i'm not too upset about because it allows us another chance to um whatchamacallit retry the glitch if you remember that i was talking about during that so let's go back all the way to mumbo's mountain and mumbo will tell us that he's too weak at some point Oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh. So right now we have 99 of the 100 possible jigsaws in the game. But once we collect the 100th jigsaw, the game's not over, folks. You know this game, a game like this, has to end in some fanfare. What? I thought I was swimming for a second, but I was ducking. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta go to Mumbo's Mountain here. Which, I think is back this- yeah, it's back this way. This layer has gotten quite big at this point. Let's just jump over you. No, this is another checkpoint. We're lost! 
Uh, it's definitely this way, though. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, okay. Because, and in a second, we'll be able to actually see in first person that jigsaw. Yeah, still there. It's weird how the autosaves work in this game, because you think as soon as you collect it, it would autosave, but no, it doesn't. So, the glitch that you can do is if you're, oh, we almost got there. If you're really good at mashing, you can just jump on the side of the mountain and get to the jigsaw, which we'll try a couple times because we've gotten really close, actually, and I've done it bef before. Come on now, come on, we can feel it. We just beat Click Clock Wood now. Come on. Oh, come on, Banjo. Oh, we're getting so close. Oh my god, I just saw him at the top. Oh, let's try the other side really quick. I don't want to get... Ah. The other side definitely seems easier. This is like trying the, the equivalent of the staircase thing in Mario 64. I don't want to quit on you guys, but my forearms... Oh. If I had a turbo controller... Alright, we're gonna do this the way the game wants you to do it. Ugh, how boring is that? Alright, so you, the game wants you to go back in here and turn into the ants. Oh, uh, remember this level? Level 1, man. Mambo, we screwed up, we need you one last time. Yeah, make me the ant again, please. If it's not too much of a hassle. Ah. God, my fucking joystick is so fucked from trying that. I actually did have a boost controller around. I still have it in my, um, like where I keep all my N64 things, but one night when I was playing Smash with my buddies, uh, I think it was actually on my birthday, the fucking, they fucked up the control stick, and, uh, the control stick now, like, the closest thing we could find to replicate, uh, like, an N64 joystick was, like, a mechanical pencil eraser, so, uh, that's that on that controller, I mean, you can still do turbo on it, but the joystick's fucked, and there we go, let's just check our totals now. And we got the little uh, jingle for Gruntilda's Lair. We got 10 out of 10. Mumbo's Mountain, everything. Treasure Trove Cove, everything. Clanker's Cavern, got it all. Bubble Gloop, got it all. Freeze Easy, done it. Gobi's Valley, been there. Mad Monster, <laughs> I think I remember that one. <laughs> Rusty Bucket Bay, yup. And click clock wood. So right now we're sitting at 900 notes and 100 jigsaw pieces. We have done everything in the game. And we are gonna go back. And there is still one last thing to do in the game, my friends. And you know what that is? We gotta fight the boss. Of course you gotta fight the boss. But... We ain't going to be able to beat the boss in like five minutes. So you know what that means? Yes, you know what that means. Next time on Brother Man Gaming, we will fight the boss of Banjo-Kazooie, Gruntilda. 
Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Have yourselves a wonderful day.